I picked up some whiskey barrel staves for about 20 bucks. They come in packs of three, and it looks like you get one large one and two thinner ones. The thinner ones are about two and a half inches wide, and the wider one is about four inches wide. I tried to sand at first, but then I decided it wasn't worth it at this point. So I took it over the miter saw, set the blade to about 45 degrees to match the angle on the other side of the stave where it connects to the barrel top. Then I tried to match the exact shape on my table saw, which turned out to be a mistake because it didn't, didn't work out too well, but I think I fixed it. Then I'm just balancing to see where I need to drill the middle hole. I'm using a one and a half inch or one and three eighths inch Forstner bit to drill the hole. Um, these drill pretty easy. I think they're white oak, but it makes your entire shop smell like whiskey and it's kind of fun. I'm just testing it out to make sure it's level and it's not level. So I ended up using a 5 8 inch drill bit to drill out these two holes on the sides. And then use a wine glass to figure out how wide I needed to cut the opening for the glasses stems to slide into. Cut them out using a jigsaw, which works pretty easy. test it out before we sand one last time. Sanding took a while, uh, but I wanted to go for a little more of a rustic look, so that's what you see here. And I even uh, took a little torch and burned around the middle hole to make it look like a bung hole. And then I just finished it with some butcher block conditioning oil. If you want to pick some of these up, I've got a link in the description to where you can buy wine barrel staves on Amazon or whiskey barrel staves. You can also pick them up at Rockler Hardware. They sell them in the packs of three that I had. And don't forget to check out my website at slightlycrookedworkshop.com and follow me on Instagram to see what I'm up to. Mm-hmm.